Hello and welcome back to another video for Final Fantasy XIV. This one probably covering old news and old information, but we're looking at some housing items today called the Bills of Contrition. Now, if you know anything about this, and this completely went past my radar, uh, there is actually some really nice looking posters and you can probably see these on the housing furniture preview mode. Now, essentially what they were, were a way of gill dumping after Square Enix erroneously pr uh, provided refunds of an insane amount uh, for people who participated in the lotteries for the Ishgardian housing when that came out. So those people could go to a housing clerk and actually purchase those things. What I didn't realize at the time is that you didn't have to even participate in that lottery at all to be eligible for this. In fact, anybody can go over to the housing lottery clerk that says Bills of Contrition, which is located here. Yeah, this, this is in any of the Imperium uh, housing areas in the firmament of Ishgard. At the Halberd's Head, uh, which is at X 10.2, Y 10.2. And on this vendor, you can dump Gil if you really wish to. It says, welcome to the apology insurance counter. Thank you for cooperating with our lottery fund reclamation efforts. It, appeared as, it appears there was a grievous clerical error which saw Gil deposits mistakenly refunded to housing lottery winners. In recognition of those honest souls who return said Gil, we are issuing bills of contrition in lieu of plot sale receipts. The prices for these bills correspond to plot size and class, meaning you shouldn't be spending a single coin more or less than what your land originally cost. Unless, of course, you're buying a poster purely for, or, uh, for an ornamental purpose, in which case I won't judge your extraordinarily expensive taste in home decoration. So, as you can see, you could choose, if you would want a house, to just keep the gill. That's, that's the first thing. So that's, that's something that, you know, they're not going to force people to do. It's a very strange thing, and it's a concept that might be unique to, uh, you know, people who feel dishonest by taking stuff that, you know, isn't theirs perhaps, or see it as less of a, well, they can keep it anyway. But they're not forcing people to do this, basically, and they never did. But even if you didn't take part in this, you can come over to the vendor and you can spend an unreasonably large amount of gill to get yourself a poster. Now, these particular posters, you can only roughly see, but as you can see, these are uh, smalls, mediums, and larges. So this is basically housing prices that you can refund now i'm not sure it's a good idea for me to actually purchase one of these considering we can look at them just simply in the housing preview menu so let's go and have a look at that but as you can see they are very expensive so if you do want some of these and you have a lot of extra gill kicking around this is where you would come to do that all right here we are in my private estate uh, over in the mist and if we go to preview indoor furnishings, you'll see on the new category, or at least at the moment it is, it'll probably move. You've got all of these different bills of contrition. It says an illustrated apology issued in lieu of a receipt of a second class plot of a small size for this one in particular purchase with Gill unintentionally refunded by lottery processing mishaps. So the small sized ones, if we put these on a wall, they have all sorts of different things. And as you can see, <laughs> it says in Eorzean text, the word sorry. It's such a strange thing, isn't it? It is, yeah, they are very strange. So the first one, S1, is um, just a Lalafell going, I'm sorry. And then we have uh, the size two one is also that. I think, yeah, they're all the same for the size ones, right? Yeah, they're all apologies. Then for the mediums, we have Namazu, which is uh, very cool. And it says, I'm very sorry. <laughs> Look at the, it's a bowing Namazu. I, I'm tempted to save up some more gill and just simply go and purchase one of these. They are fantastic. And all of those seem to be the same. And then the bill of deepest contrition. <laughs> <laughs> is uh, basically a dead Namazu that just simply is lying on its back, dead, and just says, forgive me. And that can cost in a region of 40 to 50 million gil 
for that particular poster. Is it worth it for somebody like myself who didn't take part in that lottery, who didn't receive these erroneous funds to do this? Kind of. I kind of like that. It's really, really interesting. I, I, I don't know. Maybe it's just because it's a Namazoo. But yeah, so those are cool and they're fairly big as well. Like, the, the, you know, but if you want to get, I'm sorry, I'm very sorry or forgive me on your wall with a varying degree of dying Namazoo, um, that's that's how you would go and do that. It's completely missed my radar. I, I heard about the drama, obviously, in all of the situations and I, I tried to keep out of it as much as possible because people got very, very upset with a housing situation and quite rightfully so in my opinion but uh what an interesting reward that you can get it's it's very strange isn't it very very strange anyway let me know if you went and uh, picked these up let me know your horror stories uh, to do with housing if if you had problems with this and if you just simply pocketed the gill if you did get some erroneously because not gonna lie that's probably what i would do Anyway, much love, enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.